Hi, it's Dean Holland from DeanHolland.com. So this quick tutorial showing you how to add images into your WordPress blog posts. Okay, so here we are within our WordPress admin area. Uh, as you can see here, I've started to write a little sample blog post for you. Um, just to show you what the blog post looks like currently. Here we are. Just plain, no images there. So let's come back to here. Uh, as you can read here, uh, there's actually two ways to do this, but both are pretty easy and both are similar to each other. So here's how you do it. So let's say we want to insert an image here. Um, there's this little icon just here that is add an image. So if we select that, just wait for the screen to load up, takes a few seconds. Here we are. Um, so the two ways, first way is you can add it directly from your computer. Uh, I'll show you that one first and second of all you can add it from a from a URL which is basically if the image is uploaded to your server space then you can actually just put the URL in there and it will insert the image also uh, but for now let me show you how to add one from your computer so if we select the select files button um, here we are um, if you find the image that you wish to insert so let's say we want to insert this one here if we select that, just give it a moment, there we are, and there it is, it shows you that there. Uh, you can enter a title for that, so that's a blog setup guide, there we are, and then you've got a few options here, you can insert the description, uh, you can link the image to somewhere if you wish to, uh, by entering the URL in there. Uh, alignment is another option, there we are, let's, let's align it central in this example and you can select the size either a thumbnail medium large or full size so we'll have it medium and then we just click insert into post there we are let that just pop that in for a second and there we go you can see it there if we just click update post button to the right you think it's just off your screen but it's the blue button just to the right hand side just give that a second to confirm that it's updated and there we are post updated now if I just show you that if we go over to the blog here we are hit refresh there you go you can see that's inserted the image there okay now let me show you the second way which is by adding it from a URL so I just scroll down here now let's say we want to insert this one there so again we go to this little icon above the post box that's add an image again just give that a moment to bring the screen up here we are so this time if you select from URL at the top there like I say you do have to have uploaded the image to your uh, web space to do this and you do have to know the the location of that and so what you do is here the image URL you enter that in here so http dot dot forward slash forward slash www dot um, your domain dot com and then for me it's at forward slash images forward slash one dot jpg okay you can give the image a title so for this instance we'll call that we'll just call it e-cover there we are again alignment left central or right again we'll do it well we'll do this one left uh, you can link the image to a, a destination if you wish but for this time we won't and again just click insert into post here we are just give that a moment and there you are you can see that it's been inserted here we go so if we just click update post again Just give that a second to update and there we go and now if we head back to the blog here we go hit refresh one more time and there you are uh, for some reason it's actually gone above the image I, I must have clicked my cursor in the wrong place but you get the idea that's the two ways to do it and there you go that's all there is to it okay thank you